you have your Gmail set up incorrectly. Well, maybe, I don't know. You might already have this set up this way. If not, please set it up like this and try it for like two weeks. It is the best way to do it. And that's not my opinion. It's a fact based on my opinion. So the best way to have it is unread first. So you have essentially two categories, emails you haven't read, emails you have read. Doing this allows you to use your email like a to-do list instead of it just being like blogged up or blogged up, clogged up like a toilet at a Waffle House gas station. That's not a thing. That doesn't matter. You can get gas at it. I'm off topic. This way, anytime you have a new email coming in, it goes under there. Boom, see, unread, right there. And then you can minimize it. And then this is everything you've already read. Oh, sorry, you see my emails. How to have a setup like that, this is what, you, this is what you do. Go to the gear and then you just go down to unread first and select it. Try it for two weeks, I promise you'll love it. Now, if you ever like, keep your emails as unread until you complete it. Either reply, read, whatever. If you check one and you need to keep it unread because it's not finished in your to-do list, this is how you do that real quick. CrossFit snowman, upper right, mark is unread. Boop, you're ready, boop, boop, you're ready. That way you can keep it unread till you knock it out. Okay, let me know what you think, if you like it or you don't. By the way, I got a Google course. Perfectacademy.com. Slash on a roll. Love you, bye. <laughs> you didn't know this was an ad. It's not an ad. I really just want you to get something out of the first part. But if you're here this long, we're probably in love. How are you? Can I claim you on my taxes? <laughs> That's how love works. I'm just kidding.